Hi everyone, it is Shivakumar from CC Department in Principles of Management. Today we are going to see the topic Nature and Purpose of Organizing. Designing Organizational Structure. First, Organizing. Arranging all, arranging and structuring work to accomplish the organizational goals. Organizational structure. The formation, the formal arrangement of job within an organization. Organizational chart. A visual representation of an organizational structure. Organizational design is nothing but creating or changing an organization structures. Work specialization, dividing work activities into separate job tasks. Purpose of organizing is nothing. <coughs> it is to divide work for the specific jobs and the departments and assigning tasks and responsibilities associated with individual jobs. Coordinate diverse organizational tasks clusters jobs into units and establish relationship among individual groups and departments and allocating and deploy organizational resources group in organization there are two types of groups in an organization one is said to be formal and another is informal formal in the sense work groups that are defined by the organization structure and have designated work assignments and specific tasks directed at accomplishing organizational goals in informal groups or social groups these groups occur naturally in workplace and tend to form around friendships and common interest. Formal groups. The formal groups can be divided into certain types and first one is a command group. Group that are determined by organization chart and composed of individuals who report directly to a given manager. Task group. Groups composed of individuals brought together to complete a specific job task. Cross-functional teams. Groups that bring together the knowledge and skills of individuals from various work areas or group whose members have been trained to do each other's job. Self-managed teams, groups that are essentially independent and, at, and that in addition to their own task, take on traditional and managerial responsibilities, such as hiring, planning, and scheduling, and evaluating performance. In informal groups, there are two types, interest groups and friendship groups. Interest groups normally is nothing but the people's working together to attain a specific objective with which each in concern. Friendship groups are the people's brought together because they share one or more common characteristics. Thank you.